Alright, uh, this is just a kind of a follow-up response to uh, week one games. Um, I was going to start uh, on Thursday's game, but uh, tonight's game, even though I took San Diego, I'm still pretty happy about the loss. Um, it really showed uh, a weakness on the part of the Chargers, and I love that. Um, it's uh, like I was telling somebody on Facebook a little while ago. Um, historically, the past few years, the uh, NF AFC West has been a pretty weak division besides the Chargers. But I think tonight that uh, the Chiefs kind of showed the Chargers' weaknesses. And if the rest of your division is showing your weaknesses, then you no longer have a weak division because then they know your weaknesses, if that makes any sense. Uh, 21 to 14 was the final score. Uh, Kansas City just, uh, what can I say, man? They butt fucked uh, San Diego on the national live TV, man. It don't get no better than that. Um, looking at the Chargers schedule uh, next week, you guys got Jacksonville. Jacksonville just beat uh, got uh, Denver last uh, yesterday. That was a brutal game. I lost that one. Um, my uh, weekly you pickums came down. Weekly you pickums came down to nine and seven. I was hoping to do a little bit better, but seeing that it was week one, it was like uh, all right, whatever. Um, Thursday's game, uh, Minnesota New Orleans. I took Minnesota and I lost that one. Um, I was not real impressed with Minnesota, and as a Packer fan, that uh, makes me quite happy. I don't think they uh, have what it takes. Uh, the I've always thought of the Vikings kind of as uh, the San Diego Chargers um, having what it takes to get there, but just being too cocky. And uh, I think having Brett Favre doesn't help. Um, Tennessee kicked the shit out of Oakland. Uh, I won that game. I was expecting that. Uh, Chicago beat Detroit. Uh, that's That was a big upset. Um... I've only seen the touchdown a couple more times, and the first time I saw it, uh, at the time I was on the phone with my mother, who is a huge uh, Chicago fan, and I had to tell her, honestly, after seeing it in regular speed, I couldn't tell one way or another whether uh, it was a bullshit call or not. I had to see it in slow motion, and later yesterday, later on yesterday, I did. And uh, the way they explained it with the rules uh, wasn't a bullshit call. Uh, it is what it is. Uh, their golden boy, Matthew Stafford, is out for probably the next three or four weeks. I'm guessing he's got a uh, he's got a separated he's got a separated shoulder. Um, bye bye Detroit. Uh, to the asshole Charger fan that I got into it with, who said that Detroit was going to take the NFC North. Ha fucking ha, faggot. Um, Pittsburgh beat Atlanta. I took Atlanta. Uh, knowing that uh, Roethlisberger wasn't in, uh, it was a crapshoot, and seeing that it was week one, uh, I took a gamble and I ended up losing. Uh, Pittsburgh uh, came back in uh, overtime. Uh, I seen uh, the run tonight on the uh, first halftime during the Jets-Baltimore game, and that was a hell of a touchdown. Uh, again, Jacksonville beat uh, Denver. Um, I took Denver, so I lost that game. I was not expecting that upset. Uh, I'll be looking at Jacksonville for a little while. Uh, Tampa Bay beat Cleveland. Um, that was kind of a squeaker from what I could tell. I didn't watch that game. Um, uh, Cleveland, what can I say? Tampa Bay, what can I say? I took Tampa Bay. Again, it was a crapshoot. Um, let's see. Miami beat Buffalo. Big surprise there. Uh, Giants kicked the shit out of Carolina. Again, big surprise. I took uh, both Miami to win and I took New, New York Giants to win. Uh, Houston upset Indianapolis. Um, Billy, 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 Billy Bats. Uh, what can I say? Billy Bats. Uh, what can I say, man? I feel sorry for you. Or, nah, I don't feel sorry for you. I feel bad for you. That, those are better words, Billy. In case you do end up watching this, uh, I apologize. Um, Let's see, uh, Arizona beat St. Louis. Uh, I seen that coming, and I got that one right. Again, I didn't watch that game. 
Uh, Seattle kicked the shit out of San Francisco, uh, which was kind of a surprise. I figured that Seattle would beat San Francisco. That was another one of those iffy games, seeing that it was week one and it was the beginning of the season. Um, I just didn't expect a score of 31-6, to six, so I was pretty shocked at that. Uh, Green Bay and Philadelphia. Uh, as a Green Bay fan, I was uh, sorely disappointed in Green Bay. They really got some O-line problems that they need to fix. Uh, I'm not a homer fan when they're doing bad, I will say so. Uh, I was kind of impressed. Uh, Vic was the deciding factor in that game. Um, I thought it was pretty much sealed by the uh, beginning of the second half, or about five minutes into the second half. Um, Vic had a chance to be a hero and ended up as a goat. Everybody's a dog killer, so fuck them. Um... Washington and Dallas, that game surprised me a little bit, uh, somewhat. That was another one of those iffy games that could go either way. I mean, you got the Washington with McNabb on one hand, and Washington, historically they've been an okay franchise, but lately they haven't. And then you got Dallas. You got the Tony Romo show. Romo the homo. The guy's garbage. I'm sorry, elite quarterback my ass. Um, I just, uh, I don't see it. You know, I, I don't see Rogers as an elite quarterback. I don't see Phillip Rivers as an elite quarterback. In my eyes, the only elite quarterback would probably be Manning, Manning, uh, Favre. Um, God, I mean, if you can make it to the big show, you're elite. That's all there is to it. Um, tonight's games, uh, I took the Jets to win Baltimore. I watched that game, and I was... Uh, I was uh, shocked, kind of. Um, I think that they were evenly matched. Um, that was, again, it was either either or game. Um, the Jets let me down, but that's okay. You know, it's only week one. Hopefully, I'll just get better. Uh, hopefully, I'll have some better picks later on tonight when I uh, start picking for week two, which I'll make a video later tonight for. Uh, and again, Kansas City, man. I mean, Kansas City raped San Diego. Raped. Excuse me. Flat out fucking raped him. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it was just pathetic. Uh, I was laughing my ass off because my roommates talk tall shit. Roommates talk tall shit. And I mean tall shit. About how great San Diego is. And how shitty Green Bay is. Yeah, okay. Win something, then talk shit. That's what I always tell them. When you get the rings, then you can start bucket flapping your gums. Till then, sit down, shut the fuck up, and watch the big boys. And that's all I got. Uh, that's my weekly wrap-up anyway. Uh, I try and watch as many games as I can. The only games I got to see this weekend were the Minnesota-New Orleans game, Green Bay yesterday. Uh, I wanted to watch the Dallas-Washington game, but I was uh, out of the house last night. And then tonight's two games. Um, and on a better note, uh, I have a real strong feeling that, uh, San Diego's first, uh, season opener here at Qualcomm is going to get blacked out. Uh, a few days ago they said that there was about 10,000 tickets to sell. They were talking about a possible blackout a week ago, even before the season started. Uh, slow ticket sales because of a shitty economy, and tonight's game just didn't help. Um, that's all I got. Later.